What if I told you that the secret to true inner peace lies not in external achievements, but in a practice as old as time itself? As I was wandering through the digital corridors of YouTube, I stumbled upon a video featuring Bhagavan Shanmukha, a modern sage with an ancient message. His insights into Vipassana meditation, an age-old Buddhist practice, left me spellbound. Vipassana, derived from the Pali word meaning pure insight or pure realization, is not just about sitting in silence. It's about a deep, introspective journey into the very core of your being. Greetings, dear humans. Join me as we explore the profound world of Vipassana and uncover the path to inner tranquility. Vipassana's roots stretch back to the time of the Buddha, over 2,500 years ago. It's a practice deeply embedded in Buddhist traditions, particularly within the Theravada school. The historical backdrop of Vipassana is as rich as it is fascinating, offering a glimpse into the ancient world where the quest for enlightenment was a central pursuit. This meditative practice was designed to help individuals see things as they truly are, stripping away the layers of illusion and delusion that cloud our perception. The Buddha himself is said to have attained enlightenment through the profound realization that Vipassana meditation offers. It's a method that transcends time, providing timeless wisdom in a world often consumed by chaos. Enter Bhagavan Shanmukha, a beacon of modern spirituality who breathes new life into this ancient practice. In the video, Shanmukha eloquently describes Vipassana not just as a meditation technique, but as a transformative journey toward pure realization. According to Shanmukha, Vipassana allows individuals to delve into the deepest aspects of their own selves, fostering a profound understanding and acceptance of one's inner reality. His teachings bridge the gap between ancient wisdom and contemporary life, making Vipassana accessible to everyone, from seasoned practitioners to curious newcomers. Through his words, we begin to see Vipassana not merely as a practice, but as a way of life that cultivates inner peace and harmony. At its core, Vipassana meditation is about observing reality as it is, without judgment or attachment. It's a practice that requires one to sit quietly and focus on the breath, observing the sensations in the body and the thoughts that arise in the mind. The goal is to cultivate a state of pure awareness, where one can experience the present moment fully and without distraction. This practice of mindful observation helps to dismantle the habitual patterns of the mind, allowing practitioners to see things with greater clarity and insight. By understanding the impermanent nature of all things, Vipassana practitioners learn to let go of their attachments and aversions, paving the way for genuine inner peace. One cannot discuss Vipassana without acknowledging the monumental influence of S.N. Goenka. Born in Myanmar and later teaching in India and beyond, Goenka played a pivotal role in bringing Vipassana to the global stage. His approach to Vipassana is rooted in the traditional Myanmar technique, which he refined and popularized through his teachings. Goenka's method involves intensive meditation retreats often lasting 10 days, where participants practice for up to eight hours a day. These retreats are designed to provide a deep immersion into the practice, allowing individuals to experience the profound benefits of Vipassana firsthand. Goenka's legacy is a testament to the transformative power of Vipassana, touching the lives of countless people around the world. The concept of sensory perception and its interpretation lies at the heart of Vipassana. Bhagavan Shanmukha eloquently explains that it's not the external environment or the events that disturb us, but our interpretation of these sensory inputs. 
Imagine encountering a tiger in the wild. The immediate reaction is fear. Yet Vipassana teaches that the tiger itself isn't the problem. It's how we perceive and react to the situation that creates turmoil. By training the mind to observe these sensory inputs without immediate reaction, one can learn to maintain equanimity regardless of the circumstances. This shift in perception can transform how we experience and interact with the world around us. Central to Vipassana is the understanding that the mind plays a crucial role in interpreting experiences. The Buddha emphasized that our thoughts, speech, and actions are interconnected and have a direct impact on our mental state. The Eightfold Path, a key component of Buddhist teaching, outlines principles for right thought, right speech, and right action. By aligning our actions and thoughts with these principles, we can cultivate a more peaceful and harmonious mind. Vipassana encourages practitioners to become aware of their mental processes, observing thoughts as they arise and understanding their transient nature. This awareness is the first step toward mastering the mind and achieving inner peace. The Eightfold Path is a cornerstone of Buddhist philosophy and an essential aspect of Vipassana practice. It includes right understanding, right intention, right speech, right action, right livelihood, right effort, right mindfulness, and right concentration. Bhagavan Shanmukha explains that these principles guide individuals toward ethical and mindful living. The practice of right speech and right action, for example, emphasizes the importance of positive and compassionate interactions with others. When we speak kindly and act ethically, we not only contribute to a more harmonious society, but also cultivate inner peace. Vipassana meditation supports these principles by fostering a deep awareness of our thoughts and actions. The idea of self-sabotage through negative actions and thoughts is a significant theme in Vipassana. Bhagavan Shamukha highlights how our own behaviors often lead to suffering. If we engage in negative speech or harmful actions, we inevitably face negative consequences. This understanding aligns with the Buddhist concept of karma, where actions have corresponding reactions. By practicing Vipassana, individuals learn to recognize and change these harmful patterns. The meditation practice helps in cultivating a positive mindset, encouraging kindness, compassion, and ethical behavior. This shift not only improves one's mental well-being, but also creates a more positive environment for others. A typical Vipassana meditation session involves sitting quietly and focusing on the breath. Practitioners are guided to observe their bodily sensations and thoughts without attachment or aversion. This practice helps in developing a deep sense of awareness and equanimity. Bhagavan Shanmukha describes how Vipassana encourages individuals to reflect on their thoughts and feelings, allowing them to understand their inner workings better. By regularly practicing Vipassana, one can develop a greater sense of control over the mind, reducing the impact of negative thoughts and emotions. This process of introspection and self-awareness is essential for achieving inner peace and harmony. Reflection and cognition are integral components of Vipassana meditation. Practitioners are encouraged to examine their thoughts and emotions without judgment. Bhagavan Shanmukha emphasizes that this process of reflection helps individuals understand the root causes of their mental disturbances. By observing the mind's patterns, one can identify habitual reactions and begin to change them. This heightened awareness leads to a deeper understanding of oneself and fosters emotional resilience. Vipassana teaches that by mastering our thoughts and emotions, we can achieve a state of mental clarity and peace.
Vipassana also emphasizes the separation of internal and external experiences. According to Bhagavan Shanmukha, this distinction is crucial for achieving inner peace. External events, no matter how tumultuous, are beyond our control. However, our internal reactions to these events are within our control. By practicing Vipassana, individuals learn to observe their reactions and maintain a state of inner calm regardless of external circumstances. This ability to separate the internal from the external is a powerful tool for navigating the challenges of daily life. It allows practitioners to respond to situations with equanimity and compassion rather than being swept away by emotional turbulence. Becoming a master of the internal self is one of the ultimate goals of Vipassana meditation. Bhagavan Shanmukha explains that this mastery involves understanding and regulating one's thoughts, emotions, and reactions. Vipassana provides the tools needed to achieve this level of self-control. Through regular practice, individuals develop the ability to remain calm and centered, even in the face of adversity. This mastery of the internal self leads to a profound sense of inner peace and well-being. It's a journey of self-discovery that reveals the true nature of one's mind and fosters a deep sense of inner harmony. The personal interpretation of experiences is another key aspect of Vipassana. As Bhagavan Shanmukha points out, different people can have vastly different reactions to the same event. This subjective interpretation shapes our experiences and influences our mental state. Vipassana teaches practitioners to recognize these interpretations and understand their transient nature. By observing thoughts and emotions without attachment, one can develop a more balanced perspective. This practice helps in letting go of negative interpretations and embracing a more positive and peaceful outlook on life. It's a transformative process that reshapes how we perceive and interact with the world. Ultimately, the goal of Vipassana meditation is to achieve a harmonious and peaceful mind. Bhagavan Shanmukha's teachings highlight the importance of maintaining a state of inner calm and equanimity. By practicing Vipassana, individuals can cultivate a deep sense of inner peace that transcends external circumstances. This state of harmony allows for a more fulfilling and balanced life. The practice of Vipassana is not just about meditation. It's about embracing a way of life that promotes mental clarity emotional resilience, and inner peace. As you embark on this journey of self-discovery, remember that the path to inner peace lies within you. Thank you for joining me on this exploration of Vipassana meditation with Bhagavan Shanmukha. May your journey towards inner peace be filled with insight and tranquility. Until next time, stay mindful and serene.